Hey, slow it down. Slow it down. In six more days, this dude gets his stitches out. He's trying to jump on everything, so I had to bring him up to the shop. I'm laying out the shop. I've done things a little backwards as I tend to do, but I rented the building first, and you're supposed to get like a pr like to make sure the space is approved first. But I think it's fine. Ah, uh, <laughs> what's up? But I have to do all the stuff for the health department, like now. I gotta take measurements and shit. So the idea here, we're gonna build a front counter with saloon doors. Tattoo station number one, tattoo station number two, drawing area. And then this could possibly be a sink. This also might be a sink, one or the other. And then back here, yeah, that's actually gonna be storage. And then in here, we have, this will be the podcast room, the shipping room where we keep back stock. And then as well as uh, probably somewhere I just do more art because there's quite a bit of space in here. I got a lot of work to do. It's gonna be hard to keep up with the vlog. We got a healing dog, but he's on the mend, man. Like, he's doing great, fantastic. Yeah, let me just get to work. Okay, so here we are, two weeks later. My wife's trying to get comfortable. We're headed to get these stitches out. It has been quite a journey on our um, Onar. Onar. Omar has been a little crazy. Just, he's just been ready to go. Like three days in, ready to go. So, uh, yeah. We do know, well, we'll update everything in a minute. We'll, 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 we'll get the stitches and we'll get a further update. So I don't have to do this twice. All right, so uh, one thing we're doing out here is we got the birds. Uh, Ron and Dee love watching the birds, and it is pretty cool, but we also got squirrels, and I felt bad for old squirrels not eating in the winter. Let's eat them. They're out there scrounging right now. <laughs> Yesterday we went to the vet, Omar's stitches are out. I haven't updated anybody about what's going on with him because I don't have 100% of the news. The good news is the mass that was removed, it's, it's benign, that's great. Oh, okay, cool. One more test we can run. Not everybody runs it, but run one more test just to be super, super sure. It's an extra 130 bucks. Obviously, I said yes. We're waiting to hear from that test. I'm pretty confident it's gonna be fine. Omar is raring to go, he's ready. He's gotta take an antibiotic so he doesn't get an infection in the stitch for the next 10 days. After that, he should be good. And we're just waiting on this last test. This very last test just to make sure there's no cancer or any craziness going on and he doesn't need anything further. And we will be out of the woods in that department. Yeah, the last two weeks have really just been trying to keep him as calm as possible and sort of brainstorm, ball rolling, get quotes and all this stuff here for uh, this new endeavor. A returning star from the early vlogs coming this weekend to help me build out. Well, really, I'm helping. He's building it. I'm just going to help hand him shit. Um, crazy how fast life changes. I've learned a lot in the last <laughs> uh, few months, maybe years. I don't know. It's crazy to jump into this right now, but the opportunity is here. We're here. We're staying here. Not leaving Boulder anytime soon. So... 
yeah, it should be cool. It's still a hair in one day. It's still Friday. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yes, yeah, Mars Saturday. I keep going back and forth. I don't want to spend a bunch of money doing everything, so I can spend more money on other things. Today I came here with full intention <coughs> to begin the process of painting, which I did because I started pulling shit out of the wall. There's so many screws and anchors in this wall. It's insane. I have a couple more paint guys coming by to give me a quote to see if they can do this, you know, reasonably. Like, I don't mind paying people. I get it. You know, shit costs money. It's life. But, uh... I'm trying to make sure we get the shit off the ground. But it's a lot to paint, and I kind of feel like painting somebody. I might do it myself, I might not. Life has sent me in this direction. This is not necessarily what I had planned, but uh, this building's cool. I'm excited to build it out. This parking lot is insane. There's people everywhere all the time. This is what I'm doing, you know, uh, every day right now. I don't have enough art for the walls either, so I have to do a massive amount of painting. This is an undertaking. This is a real... Life business, open to the public, a lot to do. So we're doing it. One thing we did do today though, when we left Vegas, I sold my big ass art table that I've had for a little while um, that I loved. It's vintage, it's awesome. Well, I sold it. Now, boom, baby. We got a new one that is actually bigger than the old one. Got it off Facebook Marketplace for 400 bucks. Pretty stoked on it. Keep on chipping away. That's what we're doing. Chip, 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 chip. Chip it away. Mo's bagels is over there, so we're getting a bagel. The shop is over there, so we're pretty close to Mo's, which is great. Picking up a bagel it's Saturday morning, and uh, we're just getting back back to it. We got painting dudes coming to give me more quotes, and if these guys don't meet my pricing, we're doing it our goddamn self. Mm. Monday, all right, so we're actually gonna begin construction today, I think. Sink is supposed to arrive and get put in. Painting starts tomorrow. I'm gonna cut. Getting crazy, getting healed up. Huh? Everybody sure I'm getting healed up, you all? Huh? Still organizing the basement. Pool table has been sold, so they came and got part of it. That was not an easy sell. <laughs> Selling a pool table takes a while. And then back at the shop. Yeah, we got this floor. It's driving me crazy. Originally, my idea was to tile this whole floor. There's actually tile underneath, but uh, that's really expensive even just 200 square feet. So we're gonna try and weave this back in for now. This is cracked, so that's getting fixed today. Uh, the paint job is coming soon. The guy yesterday gave me a very fair quote. Go with him, save myself some energy because I have a ton of shit to do. So tomorrow they start painting and tomorrow we're also supposed to start uh, construction. It's slow rolling. We're already like possession of the property for two weeks. We ain't got shit done. More than you think. A lot of annoying things like pulling mirrors off the walls and having them break in my hands, trying not to die in the process. What the fuck? Sager left the shop at 1.30, fucking 6 a.m. Which door is fucking open, bro? Guy. Fucking 24 hours of work. 
<laughs> Look at these solid walls we got here, son. <laughs> Coming together. Do you have any words of do you want to give any words of wisdom to the vlog? Should you tell people to start CrossFit? No, no don't uh, do it. Do it. <laughs> I don't do CrossFit. Oh, you don't? You quit? I've never done You cross quit? Never done cross Did you come up with a new name to save yourself the embarrassment or something? <laughs> um, I do functional training. Oh. <laughs> Is that what it's called? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, well, whatever you're doing, you know. Yeah. Well, it's a great shot. The red and the white. Sigur. <laughs> the blue room. We're already done. This room looks so much better already. Because we were still saying, whatever, I I'm painting it. Last night, I did the pink, and today I need to do the brown. Uh, Omar has a vet appointment. It's his final checkup. He just needs to make sure everything is good. His antibiotics have run their course, so they're just doing like a final checkup. Nothing but good news as far as Omar goes. I've been ecstatic about it. I haven't really, I've been so busy. Um, it's been hard to express myself online. Because, A, I'm trying to avoid the internet. It's absolutely... Every time I think the internet has gone to the brinks of insanity, it goes one step further to the edge. Right now, it's best for me to concentrate on this and me and what I want. Yeah. So, anyway, Omar, the mass, the huge 10 and a half pound mass, is benign, not cancer. We ran a second test, and that test came back also benign not cancer he does not have cancer which is fucking amazing it's great he is like a different fucking dog like he's back to puppy mode i'm pretty sure if i still bought shoes he would tear the box up right now he's he's crazy sorry i just noticed a spill today we gotta paint finish painting and then me and alex have to go up to frisco and we have to empty out a storage unit. Big bad Sager coming back. We're gonna get those countertops right. I don't think I showed you guys the countertops. Reclaim boxcar wood. So the bottom of boxcars, these were filthy when we got them and I just sanded these motherfuckers down. So we gotta get these all hooked up and refinished and ready for the front. Yeah, we gotta cut those back, clean them up, you know, get them all sprucey. All that, we're getting there, you know? One little project at a time. That's today, it's Monday. Oh. Also, I gotta send an email to friends and family because, of course, of course, the drop is delayed. <sighs> but what can you expect, man? What can you expect these days?